Thousands of convicts could be spotted near the state capitol this morning. Nothing to worry about. They were actually supposed to be there. Bonnie Wong explains how this all-women work crew is using their new skills to help expand a memorial project. There are always a lot of maintenance workers in and around the state capitol grounds, but the sight of prison inmates on the job is something new. These Folsom prison inmates are getting a taste of what it's like outside prison walls by doing survey work at the Mexican-American Military Memorial. Guarding trainees in the Prison Industry Authority program is a breeze. I've had no major problems with any of the offenders outside the public at all. None. That's because these inmates, the first women trainees in the construction program, are eager to get a fighting chance once they finish their terms. It brings me a lot of hope. Sandra Coulter is serving a three-year term for burglary. When she completes her training as a construction laborer, which includes laying concrete, she'll get an apprenticeship in the laborers' union. It encourages us and inspires us to want to do something different with our lives and be able to take care of ourselves and our children. The construction training program is offering to do expansion work at the memorial. Instructor Ray Borgeson said his view of women workers has changed. I thought uh, they would be difficult to work for, but actually they're very particular and they're very precise, and they do a very, very thorough job. With the economy turning around and construction picking up, these women inmates know that they have a great opportunity once they get out of prison, and they plan to make the most of it. And that training program has a prison return rate of only 7%. That, though, is compared to a 65% return rate among general prison population.